So, buddy, I'm thinking, yeah, maybe it's not the Boston Bruins or the Toronto Maple Leafs or, hell, even the Carolina Hurricanes. Maybe, just maybe, the Florida Panthers are legit. <laughs> they, they won one nothing against uh, Carolina. Not in overtime this time. They take a 3 nothing series lead. Can you believe that? You're just you're just gonna you're gonna munch your breakfast, aren't you? That's that's fair. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, Carolina is down three nothing to the Florida Panthers. Matthew Kachuk didn't even need to score the uh, OT winner this time. Of course, he set up Sam Reinhart or did it hit Bennett? I don't even know. Kachuk, Reinhart, and Bennett were on the play, on the power play. Only goal. Florida had 17 shots on goal. Carolina had 32. Florida wins 1-0. Bobrovsky is playing the best hockey of his bloody career. He's won what? What was it? 4, 8, 11. He's 11-1. And the only game he lost was barely against Toronto in game 4. Like, what the hell? Florida is <laughs> they're a juggernaut. Like Miami's up three nothing. Florida's now up three nothing. Like guys, enjoy it. Enjoy it. Um, now the game wasn't without controversy, but I like what Bro Rob Brennamore said. Like basically summing up, was there a high stick at the end of the game there on Ghost? Yes. Was it missed? Yes. Did they call the play dead? Yeah, they did. But then they didn't assess the penalty, Ren. I, I... But that's what you expect in, 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 in playoff hockey because that's been happening not just this series, but every bloody series. And I like what he said was, we still needed to score goals. We didn't just need one. We needed two to win. And I'm sorry... Rod the bod. You guys weren't scoring two last night. You hit a crossbar. Bobrovsky's nuts. There was one save in the... What was it the first? No, in the second period. Where it went to his blocker again. And he dropped the stick to make the save. Freaking nuts, this guy. Like, I can't believe how entertaining a one nothing game was it was just like last game low scoring but the goaltending and the chances it's 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 phenomenal it's fun it's fun holy crap um i thought carolina was going to be able to, to solve bob i thought this was their game i guess there's a chance maybe they'll be that 15 to come back from 3-0 instead of the leafs who, who at least won one game i guess Florida might sweep Carolina. Like, three straight wins against the Boston Bruins, down three games to one, then being down 3-1 in game seven. And then from there, it's just demolished the Leafs, even though the Leafs, you know, at least took it to overtime a few times. I guess Carolina has as well. Like, Carolina hasn't played bad. I don't think the Leafs played great. But they played like, horribly, but they didn't play great. Same with Boston. But... Is it because those teams aren't great? Is it just that Florida is that much better? And I think so, yes. Some of the comments from game two, I think, might have been game one, said like, Florida kind of like rehashed their lineup to be built for the playoffs. And damn right they have. And <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's, they're gonna go to the finals, they have to. First time since 96, like, just flabbergasted, flabbergasted. I, I'm i probably, like, my reaction right now is probably everyone in the league, especially Carolina, going, like, what the hell do we do? Well, first, score a freaking goal, but how can you win? Bobrovsky's playing that damn good. I don't think you're beating them. I don't think... Well, you need at least, what, let's say... Give or take three goals to win against Florida. You scoring three goals against Borowski right now? I don't know how you do it. 
Hell, at this point, I don't know how you get two goals against him. You've got the whole Florida Panthers team just playing ruthless hockey. And I thought their running gun style wasn't going to work against Carolina. Carolina was going to be like, thank you, we welcome it. And even when it is welcome and they're getting these odd man chances, they meet this wall who goes, you better put this puck exactly here or you ain't scoring. Carolina, they, they can't do it. They're not scoring. Uh, what else happened that? Oh, I saw Paul, Paul Maurice's uh, post, game. <laughs> post game. Talking about uh, Barkov. And went to a bat mitzvah. That's funny. Upper body, upper body, lower body injury. Just, just somewhere in between. He's, that guy's had a fantastic playoffs too. This whole Florida Panthers team has had a fantastic playoffs. God, if they make it to the final, I might have to just one. I don't want Dallas or Vegas to win. I want the winner of Carolina and Florida to win the cup. I don't have a Carolina Hurricanes jersey, but I do have a Florida Panthers Yarmir Yager jersey. Yarmir Yager's my favorite player, so. I might just have to start putting that on. Am I becoming a... I'm not a Florida Panthers fan. But I appreciate what they're doing, so I will cheer for them. I think I have to. I think that's where I'm at right now. I'm jumping on the bandwagon. I'm jumping on the bandwagon. Wow. I guess this is what happens when your team gets out. You appreciate another team, and you go, well, why not? Go for it. I'm going to hate them next year, but right now, screw it. I guess go Panthers go. Does that make me a bad Leafs fan? No, I still love the Leafs. I wish the Leafs could be here. I think the Leafs might be able to beat Carolina. But they couldn't beat Florida. Not even close. Also on that note. Alright, so let's say Carolina loses in five. Let's say they get swept. Does that mean like, because everyone says Toronto trade the core four, blow it up. Does that mean Boston needs to blow it up? Yeah, it does. I'd be fine with that actually, Ren. What about Carolina? Does that mean Carolina needs to blow it up? I don't know either. So we don't know. So Carolina probably shouldn't blow it up because they're a damn good team. Boston shouldn't blow it up because they're a damn good team. Why is it that the Leafs should blow it up? They're a damn good team who got beat by a better team. Maybe they do run it back. I wonder what the GM's going to be. Who knows? For another video. Anyway, that's it for me. Have a wonderful Tuesday, everyone. Hope you had a lovely long weekend. Florida's up three games to none with a one nothing win, and Bobrovsky's playing absolutely insane. All right, Ren. Let's get out of this traffic jam. Let's get you to daycare. Take care, everyone. Happy Tuesday.